Hey guys, welcome back to my messy craft desk. It is day 10, I believe, of the self-quarantine. And uh, to be honest, I'm going just a little bit stir crazy. And um, I'm really wanting fast food. I'm so wanting a cheeseburger and french fries. And when this is over, honey, breakfast, lunch, dinner is going to be fast food. Wendy's, McDonald's, Zaxby's. Ah, even though they're like open, um, the drive throughs I'm still a little cautious. Um, and I am going to wait until all of this is over. So, yeah, I'm, I'm kind of sick of house food, as my kids call it. So now I know how they feel. Um, but I did get up today and I did take a shower, just like every day I take a shower. I washed my hair, I got dressed, um, and now I'm going to craft. And then I'm going to dream about french fries from McDonald's. <laughs> um, if you were here yesterday, I did finish the Easter um, burst bow that I was working on. And um, I decided to put the clay piece right here in the center. I glued her down really good with my E6000. And she ain't going anywhere. So cute. I love this clay. I love this bow and I love these colors. I love Easter. Um, so yeah, hopefully I can get that this one up. But that one I worked on and I also worked on the other one but when I ended the video um, my bow parts were drying. So now I've just got to add my um, my burst center to my um, Twisted Boutique. So this one is going to be a, another cute little Easter bow. And I haven't decided what color, um, what are these, Marabou I'm going to use. I don't know if I'm going to put some yellow in there. And I also think I need to put... I don't know, I think it needs some more color or something here because there's not really any, I don't know, it, it just needs something on the side here. But this is the clay that I'm going to use on this bow. It's a little bit smaller than the one I did yesterday, but she's going to go right there in the center. But yeah, I think I'm going to put maybe this. Because I don't think I have any, yeah, yeah, I don't have any of this color. So I think I might put this maybe on one side of the loop. And I don't know, maybe something on the other side. Hmm. Decisions. So yeah, I think this, or should I do the, the bigger one? I don't know. What should I do? I should do the smaller one. All right, so I've got this color. But what can I put on the other side, on the other loop? And put one at the top and one at the bottom. Hmm. All right, so I'm going to decide on that, but I do know this is going to go. And um, these are going to go somewhere. So, yeah, that's the other Easter bow. And I think I'm not going to do any more Easter just because, you know, we're so close to Easter. And I want, the, I want these to be shipped and um, get to whoever buys them in a timely manner. So yeah, those I worked on. And today I am working on um, the, where is it? The sloth. I'm gonna work on the sloth. I'm gonna make a bow for this little felty. And to match the sloth mode ribbon and I've already got I've started my my loopy part um, this is going to be another burst bow I've already got my loops I just need to do some filler and um, I didn't have the the corkers the colors that I needed um, so I did have to make some this morning here they are right here I got a green, a dark purple, light purple, and like a, I don't know what that teal blue color is. So, yeah, I know I'm going to put some corkers in here, and I don't know, maybe some of that sloth print as the filler. 
I don't really have any any more um, of this in different colors. This type. I've only got like reds and this yellow and some orange. I need to buy some more, but you know, I ain't leaving my house unless it's for toilet paper, which we've still got some, so I don't have to leave. <laughs> I hope you guys are handling everything well. I hope you're doing okay. <laughs> Let's just put it that way. I know some of you are going stir crazy, at, like me, because um, a lot of you are on, we're Facebook friends, so yeah, this is crazy, but it will pass. Like all other craziness, it will pass. I just wish it would pass sooner rather than later. We were thinking that my husband's job, um, that they were going to go ahead and close. So we were kind of worried about that. Even though he does have vacation and like sick time he could have used, but who knows, you know, when this is going to be over. But they just changed his hours and um, which he's salary anyway so it's really not going to affect him but it will affect those under him so yeah for all of those out there that have lost jobs or your hours have been cut I sympathize with you so much this economy is just I don't know it's going to be it's going to take a while to get back to normal but we will all right so I'm just going to Clip up some corker and what is this for? Oh, the sloth. I should really uh, finish bows before I start other bows, but that's not how my brain works. If you understand me, um, yeah, let me know because I'm just like, oh, pretty ribbon, and then we go to the next one. Oh, another pretty ribbon, and then yeah. So um, I need to focus. That's what I need to do. Is I need to focus. It's hard for me. And then also, I am wanting to buy more ribbon. Yeah, like I don't have enough. But it's like if I see something cute, I'm like, oh, that's just such a good idea. I need to get that. But, um, yeah, I'm going to start quarantining my debit card because your girl likes to shop too much. Whew. I do. I like to shop too much. Alright, I'm just going to cut these corkers up. Alright, I just finished cutting and sealing all of the corkers. Now I just need to um, figure out what I'm going to put as my other filler ribbon. Maybe some of this pink. And we'll do a pink and do a sloth. No, I'm going to use that for the Twisted Boutique. Let's see, I've got a purple and I've already got a sloth in the middle. So I'll do some pink. Hmm, I'll do some pink and some, maybe some solid purple. And I've got some solid purple right here. Um, do you guys have the Apple TV app? I, it's free to download, but I think that there's some things on there that you have to pay for, but I don't pay for it. Um, I've been watching those uh, carpool karaoke shows, and they're like little 20-minute clips. It's from that guy that does the Late Late Show. Um, I can't think of his name right now. Um, but he's usually the one in the car with the celebrity. Um, they're really good. I like to watch those. But anyways, the one I watched today, I think it was the latest one was um, the kids from Stranger Things and um, it was really cute and I was shocked that most of the music they chose was 80s and 90s and those kids knew the entire songs and it was it was neat to watch and see how they interacted. Um, they sang, what did they sing? Um, Stevie Nicks, they sang some Elton John. There was a song um, from today that they sang at the very beginning. Um, they sang Biggie. I love it when you call me Big Papa. I mean, it was just songs like that. And they knew every single word to the songs. Um, I was shocked. But I guess they had to do a lot of research on the 80s 
when they um, signed on to the to do the show because they said that was their favorite genre was 80s um, anyways it was cute again it was free to watch 20 minutes but um, yeah I really enjoyed it now I didn't realize that um, what's the girl um, 11 I didn't realize that she was like British um, she had a British accent and I did not realize that which I'm sure my kids could have told me that but but yeah it was just strange hearing her talk as it is when you know other British actors when they're in like American roles I mean they talk better <laughs> English and with a better accent than I do and I'm you know I've been born here I was born here y'all but um yeah anyways so it was cute and yeah I really like the uh, the Stranger Things um, Dustin is my favorite. I think he's so cute. Um, I really wasn't a fan of Mike. Or not Mike. What's the Mike? Yeah, Mike. He kind of thought he was the leader of it all, you know. So, anyways, my kids love that. I think Reagan has watched all of the seasons like four times each. I'm not even kidding. She's crazy like that. All right. Um filler ribbons. I need some small. Uh, let's see. What can we do? We got the purple and we got a pink. Should we do... Is there turquoise? No, there's no turquoise. Okay. I got this right here. I guess we could put some of this in there. I'm cut these a little bit longer. Just two pieces of that. Alright, I'm going to seal these. This is my hardest, the hardest part of making like a loopy bow is finding out, hold on, my husband's calling. Alright, sorry about that. My husband is on a meat hunt. <laughs> He's at the grocery store trying to just see if we can secure some ground beef or anything other than chicken. I've got a couple of packs of chicken. But to be honest, I hate cooking chicken. Um, I don't know. Unless I'm going to like shred it to put it in something. But I don't feel confident. Or I've never really felt confident frying chicken. Um, just because I'm always scared that it's not done. And I hate poking into my meat to see if it's done but I've never I've just never been confident cooking chicken like that anyways now I'll bake chicken but I don't like baked chicken I just don't I like fried chicken I like chicken tenders I like chicken in like casseroles I like chicken salad I just I don't know baked chicken I don't know and I'm not a breast fan I'm more of a dark meat fan um I hope we get on that subject. Anyways, he, yeah, he said that they, there was, uh, he had just missed it by 10 minutes, the ground beef, and he was walking out, and there were a couple of people with baskets piled high. So, that's irritating, but what can you do? So, we'll have a pack of bacon and a pack of smoked sausage to go with my pack of chicken, and then I'll have to get creative. <sighs> This will pass. This will pass. Alright, so. I've got all this. I feel like I need something else. Maybe we'll put some little. I'm, I'm running low on these. And I just bought these. I don't even know if I have a color. Oh, goodness. I don't even know if I have a color that. Ooh. I might have to do these two for my Easter bow. And this one. I don't know. That's not going to go. Ah! I didn't think about that. I wonder if I have an ostrich puff. Okay, I've got white. I've got white. Oh, I have a purple. Okay, I think we're good. I think these will be. Okay, but I really need to ration those out because I didn't realize I was running out. <sighs> Just when I said I was going to stop buying. I think I've got an ostrich puff somewhere. I don't know. We'll see. Um, I don't know. I feel like it needs something else. It needs like some crunch. Some crunch in the middle. But I don't have anything. Well, I probably do. But it's a mess in here. It needs to be clean. Maybe I'll do that. I won't make y'all watch me clean it. Though. Um, 
Mm, I need some crunch, y'all. I need some crunch. Oh, I'm also running low on um, glue sticks. Oh, my goodness. I might have to fight the ladies at Walmart today. So, yeah. Let's put these in stacks. And, no. I'm going to make the Twisted Boutique for this. What colors am I going to use? I'm kind of tired of using purple. I've used purple on the Easter bows. And, I'm kind of tired of purple. So, I don't know. I'll be right back. Oh, by the way, I created a town on Animal Crossing. Yes, we all got Animal Crossing, um, was it yesterday? Kennedy got it, Reagan got it, and then my husband got another copy, um, so we could play. Yes, yeah, so we have three Switches. The girls actually got their Switches, the, what, the handhelds, um, for Christmas, the new ones, and then my son has the original. So we've been playing on the original, and they have their own. But anyways, I created a town, and I'm not really sure how to share it or visit other towns right now, but once I figure that out, I'll hook y'all up, because I know some of y'all got it, um, and maybe we can play together, even though I, I haven't really figured most of it out. I mean, I created my little character, and my town and you know put my tent up but other than that i just shut it off so i could finish these bows so yeah that'll be fun keep me busy like i need another thing to keep me busy all right i'm just gonna put the twisters together all right first i gotta undo them you just undo your loops that makes them loopy Gosh, I love this bow. I love loops, but y'all know that. I'm a loopy girl. I'm not much of a flat, like a pinwheel girl. I'm a loopy girl. I always have been. It's really hard for me to make a flat bow, too. It's just like my fingers don't want to go that way. All right, now I'm going to put these two together. This ribbon is like perfect. You're not going to need to spray it because it's, it's already kind of thick. All right, I just got to secure these in place and then put that on top. And then, um, yeah, but let me get these other bows so I can show you real quick before I sign off. Okay, I finished the sloth bow and the always on point. Ooh, glue strings, I hate those. Um, I did add a bottle cap to the Always On Point, and after I finished this bow, I remembered that I had something specifically planned for this ribbon, and of course I forgot um, until I'd already made up a burst bow, but I think I have a little bit left, and I might do what I had planned to do. But anyways, here is um, the Always On Point. I've got the ribbon on this side. There's black on one side, yellow on the other. It's like a glitter yellow. Got a little tool up here. It's actually black and pink, but the black is hiding back here. And like I said, I did the always on point um, bottle cap image. So yeah, there is that one. And then I did the sloth bow. And I've got that cute little sloth felty. And then right on this loop, we have the ribbon that says sloth mode. And then on this loop over here is the um, pink and white dot, the big dot. And then we've got more tulle, not tulle, uh, marabou. And um, yeah, there's that one. I love that little sloth. These are really lightweight bows, by the way. Um, they're not too heavy. So, there are the two bows, and yeah, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this video up, and I'll see you guys in the next one.